On December 3rd, 2007, the KEL Cancer Fund was born. For the month of February, $7 will be donated for each free throw the USF women's basketball team sinks in. Sandra K. Yao was the first woman to be a full-time head coach for the North Carolina State women's basketball team. She was one of the most decorated NCAA coaches of all time, despite being diagnosed with breast cancer in 1987. Before passing, Yao began a cancer fundraiser that influenced women's basketball forever, including the USF Bulls. It inspires us as basketball players, and being a basketball player, it definitely motivates us to know it's bigger than the game. This definitely impacts it with it being such a big deal and being a crisis around the world. The University of South Florida's women's basketball team happily donated $7 to the fundraiser for every free throw that is made for the month of February. The team averages 12.3 free throws a game. Sophomore Tamara Henshaw believes this is a subconscious incentive to sink in more free throws than ever before. We are definitely pushed more to make our free throws knowing that it's going to a great cause. It's inspired me to play as hard as I can and to support the people that are in need, especially those being affected by breast cancer, cancer in general. Kay Yao remained gracious and hungry through her final days. Not only did she lead teams to Olympic medals, championships, and success, she demonstrated the meaning of poise and perseverance. Yao passed away on January 24, 2009, but her powerful legacy will live on forever. If every school in the nation comes together and knows, hey, we're women's basketball and we are playing for K, then this, this is a big deal. And, you know, we, we can butt heads on the court and do competition, but at the end of the day, like we said, it's bigger than the game. Here at the University of South Florida with Campus Connect, I'm Rachel O'Neill.